Stealing His Majesty's munitions is a hanging offense, gentlemen. Besides, I bring you employment. What is it, Taylor? Have you secured the trading contracts with His Majesty's army? There is no problem, is there, Taylor? Have you, as usual, failed? I have secured a trading pact with you and the Senecas. I think you're handing him his death. Your inheritance is now mine. Not by my grace could it ever be yours again. Was it? An enormous effort to adapt to my brother when you married him all those years ago. And the reason I married William to get away from my father annoys at me. And what can happen to you by my grace, dear brother? It's done. Witnesses? Just one. A woodsman. Look, I killed Doyle. Our casualties in war. There's money to be made in London. Men such as I don't get rich in London. Which is why I came here. I was told British officers couldn't hold in England. They cannot. Money is what you see, Taylor. Because that is what he took from me. Joyfully, his death will balance the ledger. Present! I have always wondered if it is not the reason he took you from me as well. Do I have a family, Elizabeth? No. Then leave this affair to me. Of our days of courting. That was a long time ago. Yes. And before you met my dear brother. What do you mean you want your money back? What if I simply refuse to return it to you? I will have to terminate our relationship. And claim you were spying for the French. Where does this man now? He said he'd wait at the tavern. Need I be concerned about my brother? That depends on what you fear, Captain. What's your read on him? He's probably a liar. In which case, he will prove to be a dead liar. Your brother's still alive. Mr. Sharp will bear talking to again. Not for long. He'll be hanged at dawn. Fate sometimes plays funny tricks. <laughs> 